Under the business judgment rule, courts presume that corporate directors act on an informed basis, in good faith, and in honest belief that their business decisions are in the corporation's best interests. Consequently, absent proof of self-dealing or waste, directors will only be liable if their decision-making process was grossly negligent or they acted in bad faith. In ATR Kim Eng Financial Corporation v. Araneta, the Delaware Court of Chancery considered whether directors acted in bad faith by failing to independently monitor and prevent self-dealing by another director. In 1999, ATR Kim Eng Financial sought to acquire a controlling interest in a corporation that sold pre-need insurance policies. The chairman of ATR's board reached out to Carlos Araneta, a business owner and friend, about a joint venture. ATR and Araneta then entered into a joint venture and undertaking agreement. Under the joint venture agreement, Araneta agreed to purchase a controlling interest in the corporation. ATR agreed to advance Araneta $4 million, and Araneta agreed to contribute his own businesses, along with his controlling interest in the corporation, to a new holding company. Further, Araneta agreed to give ATR a 10% minority interest in the holding company. In January of 2000, Araneta formed the holding company and gave ATR 10% of its shares while retaining control over the remaining shares. Araneta served as chairman of the holding company's board and appointed two directors who were employees at his businesses. The directors completely deferred to Araneta in corporate matters. In addition, the board didn't have regular meetings or put in place corporate information or reporting systems. Later, Araneta transferred his businesses, which were worth more than $35 million, from the holding company to his children for no consideration and without notice to ATR. The directors didn't participate in, approve of, or directly profit from the transfer. Subsequently, ATR sued Araneta and the holding company in the Delaware Court of Chancery for breach of fiduciary duties. ATR alleged that Araneta breached his duty of loyalty and engaged in self-dealing by transferring his businesses to his children for no consideration. It also alleged that the directors were jointly and severably liable for breach of fiduciary duties for failing to monitor Araneta and prevent his self-dealing. The case went to a bench trial. 